Hello my fellow Aldi addict, it's Jackie. It's another Sunday and I'm finally shopping the same day I'm sharing this with you guys. It's been a few weeks since I've been able to do that. Let's get into the store, see what goods they have, and don't forget at the end, I'm gonna share with you my meal plan for the week. These are new. I would 100% be buying this if I lived on a lake. A lake house is a dream of mine someday, obviously. Too big for the pool. But we have lots of big items here. We have pools. Quick set 10 foot pools that are $70. Planter boxes, gallon deck boxes, fire pits. Lots of red, white, and blue balls. Okay, I'm getting two bags of these because I'm obsessed and I don't want to run out again. $2.19, they're so good. I just snack on them or put them on salads or on cottage cheese. $2.19 a piece. My son requested mini muffins to go with his breakfast this week, $2.49. I'm getting these aged cheddar and black pepper chips to go with our Jimmy John's dinner, $2.49. We're having a creamy lemon pasta dinner. I'm gonna get a baguette to go with it on the side, $1.69. Love seeing this price on strawberries. I'm gonna get four containers. I'm also gonna get a bag of grapes at 95 cents a pound. I still have watermelon from last week, but if I run out, I'm gonna come back. It's still 3.89, which is such a good price. I'm gonna get some bananas for 44 cents a pound. My son requested these. Cilantro at 85 cents. Woo! And green onions at 85 cents for walking taco night. I'm getting broccoli for steamed broccoli, although this does not look, most of this does not look very good. Yeah, that one looks all right. $1.79 a pound. I need limes and lemons. $2.29 for the limes, $3.89 for the lemons. These will last us quite a while, thankfully. I need lettuce for any salads we have, and also the Jimmy John subs, $2.95. We are out of apples, and none of the prices look amazing, but apples are such an easy side to add to things, so I'm going to get a bag at $4.29 for Pink Lady. We like this version. So last week we did like the Mama Cozy's dough, but I like working with my homemade dough better than this, so I probably won't buy it often. It's a mystery price for the uh, gallon of 2%, no, $2.92. And I'm getting whole milk at $1.75 because we're making homemade ice cream. I got a new ice cream machine and we're making it when my daughter comes home from camp. We're all very excited. For the ice cream, I also need half and half, $1.95 for this. I'm getting two Roma tomatoes for the Jimmy John subs. So I'm gonna get these, no, not that one. These two look pretty good. It's $1.35 a pound. For the walking taco bar, I'm gonna get grape tomatoes and I'll have them. So I'm gonna get one for $2.29. I need four cans of sweet corn for my corn salsas and also for the KFC bowls, 54 cents a piece. 71 cents for a can of black beans for the black bean and corn salsa. Also gonna get another can for walking tacos. I'm getting Vidalia onions at $2.19. I just ran out of onions. And usually I pick whatever is the cheapest light variety. So, Vidalia wins. I need jalapeno for my black bean and corn salsa. Also for the walking tacos, 65 cents. 97 cents for croutons. And these are new, I've never seen those before. No price though. 249, need lemon juice, ran out. They have these outdoor poofs. We love having these outdoor seating by our pool. I don't have the Aldi brand, but if I hadn't bought them last year, I'd be looking for these. Folding rockers are $90. Folding padded chairs, $65. Mini wooden carving sets. I love, I have a pineapple slicer. I don't have one from Aldi, but they work really good. Absolutely love my steel walk. Again, it's not from Aldi, but I love it. I think this is really adorable. A utensil caddy. Oh, a fan phone charger. That's cool. I love this serving bowl. That is so pretty. 
$20. Lots of different welcome signs. I saw this one. I think it's adorable. I don't need any signs, but I love them. Pet pools. Serving trays. I am very tempted to get this for our pool, $25. They have puddle pails, big puddle jumpers, $15. Pool shoes, pajamas, camisoles, ladies swimsuits, $10. It's so, to me it feels very late in the season to be shopping for swimwear, so this is kind of a little late in the game in my opinion. The bonsai obstacle courses. Five dollar goggles, that's a pretty good price. Backpack cooler, that seems convenient. My son is obsessed with these, the bunch of balloons. It's a really good price for them too, we just have some at home. I love these floor pillows. I just don't have a spot for them. I really like the square ones even better. And unfortunately we don't have like matching sets. I would rather have like two of the same one, but they're only $20, which is a really good price. Those are pretty. Box fans. I literally have been looking for a doormat, and this comes now. I missed the mini gnomes, but I almost wish I would have gotten this one instead of the big one last week, because that's super cute and it would look good at the fireplace. So my son almost bought this last week with his own money, but I told him to wait. Um, I really just don't know if he'd use it, but it's on clearance now. So maybe next week I'll buy it for his birthday, which isn't until September, but I'm going to think about it. Has anyone had their kids play with it and they actually like it? We lost the rest of our rice when a 12 year old dropped her phone in my pool. So thankfully nothing was wrong with it, but uh, 545, I need more rice. I need a pack of brown gravy for KFC bowls, 30 cents. Getting sprinkles, 2.99 to put into the ice cream machine toppings. I'll put a picture up of what we got. Very excited to load it. The creamy lemon pasta. I'm gonna get this elbow macaroni. Uh, it's only $1.39. That'll work well. My daughter requested pineapple juice. It's so expensive I don't buy it often, but she loves it. $3.89. So my theory has panned out that as soon as they limited the chicken breast, they were in stock. I think restaurants were literally buying all of them. But ever since the limit's been in place, I've been able to find them. I'm not getting any, but I just wanted to share. This is still like the grilling cabinet. Lots of frozen meats here to grill. Plant-based burgers, which I'm interested. If anyone's a vegetarian and likes plant-based burgers, let me know. My vegetarian will not eat anything that's supposed to look like meat. She just thinks that's gross. They have Asian meals over there, shrimp, pierogies, um, chicken breast nuggets. Those look pretty good. Asian medleys. I don't see much new. Lots of pot stickers, grain bowls, buffalo egg rolls. Those were there last week. Um, these breakfast pita sandwiches. Pizzas. Lots of different pizzas in here. They have the lemonade bars still. They have pies over there. They look like they're all cherry. I might have to see if they have a strawberry rhubarb. Um, I've been told those are worth getting. Lots of the Magnum bars. Coffee Vanilla Delight Gelato. Now, does that not sound amazing? My daughter would love that. Chocolate Vanilla Cookie. Chocolate Coconut Crunch. Wow, those look good, but uh, they're $4 a piece, so probably not something I'll get today. Monster Cherry Pineapple Pops. Those look yummy. Lots of different ice creams. We've had the unicorns in the past. My kids like them. Root beer bars. Cookie dough bites. Lots of stuff to get me in trouble on this side. 
But here we are with the waters. I'm getting a tangerine and so grateful they have original. I've missed my sparkling water, $3.49 each. I need lots of cheddar this week, so I'm getting two of these, $2.59 a piece. I'm also going to get one of the Mexican style at $2.99. I need provolone for our subs, $1.99. I spy with my eye some of my original flavors. I'm gonna get six of them if I can find them, 79 cents a piece. They have these portable window air conditioner units, uh, $149. These are still $299 instead of $449. Looks like yard waste haulers. I don't see a price on them though. So the conversation set, these are marked down to $150. My husband requested these sausages to go with our waffles, $1.39. Okay. I got a box of French toast sticks at $2.69. I've been wanting these for a while. Arctic bars at $2.45, just like Klondike bars. And then my husband requested a pail of vanilla ice cream at $5.79. I've never seen these before, and they're all marked on festival. I must have just missed them. But I came over here for these apple straws, $2.49. I love this. My kids like them too. I'm gonna take this video to show my husband. These are marked half off for our foldable sawhorses. Okay, $1.69. I was about to check out and I realized I forgot sour cream, and I need that for my corn dip. I'm actually buying two of these. I still have some from last week, but they were so good. They're an Aldi find, and I love having just, I love the ability to just have one of these to close out my eating window. I eat one meal a day, and sometimes I don't want dessert, but I love to have a little bit of sweetness, and this is perfect. So, these are going in mom's stash, $2.49 a piece. Or here's my cart, any guesses on the total? Okay, my total was $118.31, and here's my cart packed. Walking Tacos once again got bumped. We had a lot of leftover chicken, so I kept using it for different dinners. And with my daughter coming home from camp at the end of this week, she requested we had Walking Tacos, so I didn't feel like having it twice very close together. So we're having that this week when she comes home. We're having homemade Jimmy John's. Basically, I have all the ingredients on hand, and then I buy Jimmy John's day-old bread. We'll have chips, fruit. It'll be a really easy, probably by the pool dinner. I'm gonna make homemade waffles. We'll also have fruit and then anyone that wants eggs I'll make on the side for that. We're going to have famous bowls from KFC. Again, homemade. I'll make the mashed potatoes, make brown gravy, have popcorn chicken, and I have some popcorn chicken in the freezer, which is what I want to use up. And then we'll also have corn and shredded cheddar. Uh, everyone can make their own. Easy dinner. We're going to take out pizza. We haven't done that in a few weeks and it sounded good to me. Creamy lemon pasta. My older daughter doesn't really like cream and lemon together, but the rest of us do, so we're going to get that in before she comes back from camp. And then finally, it's my sister-in-law's birthday this week, and we are going to my in-laws. We do a birthday dinner for everyone, and my mother-in-law makes most of the food. It's going to be Mexican, um, but I'm going to make a corn and black bean salsa, and then also I'm going to make a cheesy corn dip that has mayo, sour cream, cream cheese, and this is our menu for the week. If you're intrigued by Jimmy John's and KFC and you want to see a whole week where I made all fast food inspired dinners at home, you can check out this video right here. Thank you so much for watching. Ciao, Donna, ciao.